everybody welcome back to my channel it's the Oni with thrifty divas and i'm here with my lately what has been my weekly thrift store haul because my local thrift store and again if you're local it's island thrift um is doing six color tickets uh on wednesdays so i've been trying to get there whenever i can and uh this week was no exception so this is the second video I'm sitting down to film right here in this spot, but we're just gonna get right into it. Uh, not too much organization in terms of category. Almost every ticket in the store was 50% off, basically except for yellow and white with a red stripe, which I never really get stripes anyway. I do have some things here that the price has already been removed, but luckily I remember them because that's how I am. So let's just jump right in. Stop jibber jabbering, Theoni, and here we go with this week's thrift store haul. So the very first item I picked up, you know I had to. This is crazy. It is this gorgeous leopard print. It's really nice too. It's like textured. I love it. So it's all, it's like a book, but it's this little box, little box with a little magnetic closure and uh, 99 cents half off. How could I not? That's crazy. 50 cents for that. Second thing I picked up so I, I should also let you know, because it's going to come up several times in this haul, I have been become very into watching resellers. Not like I want to be a reseller, but I just enjoy learning the value of things that I may have not known about. And, you know, I love vintage things to begin with. So stuff like that. Um, so I have been looking into it a lot. And this is the first haul that I have actually picked up a couple items on a huge risk. I mean, not too much of a huge risk, but on a risk um, that I'm going to try to resell. Just like, it's just like one or two things, like whatever, to see how it goes. But I don't know. I think one or two here or there, if I have any success, would just be fun because then you feel like you accomplished something. I'm not doing it to make money, but I'll feel like, yes, I did that right. You know, kind of thing. Do I make any sense? I hope so. But so that's why. So this is a vintage wallet. Okay. Not, not much on the resale at all. I checked, but it is a Buxton soft touch lambskin little vintage ladies leather wallet. Well, lambskin wallet. And I just loved it because it kind of like reminds me of the things I used to see growing up, like with my mom or what was left of my grandmother's stuff after she passed away. I don't know. So I just really liked it. And it says Buxton in there. So this was $2.59 half price. I thought that was great. And just for like nostalgia purposes. Uh, then my son and his bags. These were not half price. They had like no half price bags. So this one was $3.99 better be a good one. <laughs> better be a good one for $4. So this is what it looks like on the outside. Actually, this one, I think I did take a glance and approve it because I saw some vintage stuff in here. So let's see what we got. So the first thing that we got is this very, very strange thing with its, it looks like its ears are broken off. I have no idea. If anybody knows what that is, let me know. That's kind of horrifying and the legs do move and there's like a screw at the bottom. It scares me a little bit. Okay, so there's that. Then check this out. This says 1982 Play School Muppets. This is metal, metal on the bottom. Big Bird Builders, little dump truck, Big Bird there. I might have to keep some of these things away from him, which he's already used to. We've discussed, we've discussed some things. <laughs> once, uh, <clears throat> once we find out some things, sometimes it needs to be kept away from him. This is a 1981 Muppets by Hasbro. Again, metal bottom. Uh, this is a train not as not in as good condition as the um, Big Bird one. This is Cookie Monster. He's got a little wear on him. Cookie wheels, little choo-choo train. And you can see the paint has come off there, but that is metal. 1981. Then we have this. And this is 1991 Kellogg's. Company. I'm wondering if this came in a box of cereal. Were they still doing toys in boxes at that time? I can't remember. 
we got that one. And then that's, that's Scrooge, right? This is 1988 Walt Disney Company, made in West Germany. And this one, it's actually uh, too shiny for me to read on his foot, but it looks like he was supposed to be riding something. I don't think there's a date though. Not from what I can see, so there's that. And then we have this guy. I believe this one says 1991 on the bottom. And the last one here, this is another Kellogg's one, 1991. All right, so that's it on that bag for $3.99. The next bag was $1.99. This is what we're looking at externally here. All right. <laughs> this says Rinko. I don't know if he's old or not. There's no year on it, but he's kind of faded. And then what is this? This looks like some type of uh, transforming. Okay, I just saw this is a 2017 Pokemon something or other. I don't know. I never, I'll see if, uh, if, I, if I end up finding any values that I did not know about, I will always add them to the video. But uh, here's this guy. And then we have this. No visible year on this. I don't know what this is, but uh, I will check if I find anything. This is a 2019 Monster Jam car, Fire and Ice. Uh, this said $4.99, wherever it was from. But that's a uh, Sully. I love that. I pr and I love that it's like a stand. So. I think I like that probably more than he ever will. Um, this one. <clears throat> no year. Oh, this was made for McDonald's. This little guy. And then we got this guy from Frozen. This is also McDonald's 2019. And uh, I see a pullback, hold on. He just uh, wheels, he's got a little wheel there. And then the last thing in here, this is 2017. I don't really know what this is, but this uh, does something. So that's that. All right, so that was that second bag. And now let's, uh, get away from the bags. I'm sure you'll all appreciate that too. All right, next I found this book that I really just wanted to get. It's called 101 More Things. So I guess there's a first one to do with cake mix. And this was $2.99 half price. So this was only $1.50. There's, so there's cookies, there's bars. Pie, breads, and children's delights. So we have cupcakes, more bars, a crunch, pizzas. That just look fun and like semi-homemade and easy. Then I got this for my son. <laughs> this is the 2007 hit CGI movie, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles on DVD. This was $2.99, half price, so it was $1.50. You know, I never even checked. I heard the DVD in there. Yes, okay, but I didn't check to make sure that's what it was. All right, and then I, just because vintage, 
I found this. This is a ratchet screwdriver set in the original box, although the sides are all torn up. There's no year on it that I can find. Best ever, best quality. Just look at how beautiful that is. Just look. So this was $3.99 half price. I paid $2 for this. And that's what it looks like inside. It's pretty cool. I haven't shown my husband yet even, but so I don't know. Um, I don't know if I'm gonna hold on to that or try to sell it, we'll see. But I, I, I might just wanna hold on to it because it's super cool. So I have not decided yet. Then, uh, not vintage at all, <laughs> my water bottle has been like breaking more and more and more because I like dropped it again and all this stuff. Anyway, so I picked myself up this silver glittery one. Um, it's the kind I don't like though. It's like the, you know, the like soft, I like the hard one. But whatever this is like brand new it was absolutely never used it's probably a gift or someone like won it or something and never used it um and this was a dollar nine where's a dollar 99 full price but i thought that was totally worth it especially because it's glittery and i love glitter uh next i found this no no brand you know some cheesy not not like licensed not mlb um velcro back trucker's hat with the uh, new york mets logo it was 3.99 half off and it actually looks super cute on my son so that is for my son even though it's an adult size um i tried it on and it looks so i have a, i know where he got his huge head from and it's me there's no there's no surprise there so it looked too small on me but it looked it looked great on him it looked adorable so that's for him for two dollars then okay so this is my craziest item that I purchased strictly for resale. My first big purchase. I mean, it's not like huge, but it's pretty big, like to take a risk. But I feel kind of good about it. All right, so it's these. They are so heavy, it's like bizarre. So I bought these Red Wing motorcycle boots. They're obviously used. They are a men's size 10. So I thought that was like a good size. Um, they have a little, a little scuffing, but I think to the point where they're um, desirable, because some people desire the scuffing like a little bit to make them look a little worn in. So I think that's the point that they're at. They're not like bad. Um, so yeah, so these were, I know I'm like crazy, but see and then it's got the red wing shoes there on the front um these were 18.99 full price but um i will put in prices here i will put in sold comps here not just asking sold comps here for what these go for all day um and on facebook marketplace as well all day all day but as you can see, that's why I took that risk and I thought it was just pretty good for fun. Then as I was walking up to the register, I saw this little guy and I saw the face. I'm like, I know that face. So this is a 1985, I believe, uh, or six Cabbage Patch doll. And this is a preemie. That's why he's got the tuft of hair. So the, it was the preemies that had the tuft of hair. And um, I think this is blue, so I have to look. Yeah, I think this is an 85, if I'm not mistaken. But this is a Cabbage Patch preemie. I wish it was the original clothes or at least Cabbage Patch clothes, but it is not. And that is fine. Um, I just wanted to, again, just kind of have one in my vintage collection um so this stays and that was 6.99 half price so he was 350 for a cabbage patch preemie i believe in 1985 i have to check the color of the butt on the preemies because it was different for one year um so if it was if it was a regular doll i could tell right away from the signature but, but i never dealt with preemies before uh, all right so that's that and then my son handed me this and I had to get this little guy. I just had to, I had to. The 
It's an embroidered tag, okay, which right away usually shows you that something's up, which is good. Um, this is an R uh, Dakin, Dakin and Company, 1978, guys. 1978 on that tag. This little guy's older than me and uh, I just had to get him. And he was a dollar 99 half off, so he was just a dollar. Yeah, had to. Then uh, more modern day stuff. Uh, I found this and then I asked my son, I said, do you wanna get this? for that space underneath your loft bed when we put it together. Like, I think this would be cool and it would probably project, you know, underneath. Um, and he was like, yeah. So this is a cute little sea turtle and it's like light and sound. I haven't tested it out yet though. This is a uh, summer by summer infant and it's called uh, Swaddle Me. I don't know what it is, but there's the, the battery pack in there. I haven't, haven't tested it, but. Uh, I figured I would take the risk at $2.99, half price. So this guy was $1.50. And then I found this for my son as well, and I figured he would like it, and he wanted it. So this is a 2003. This is a little uh, Stingray, Mana Ray, I don't know. I told you his sea animal stuff, right? So this was 99 cents, half price. <laughs> so this little guy was 50 cents and look at his face. That alone, right? I mean, come on. Then my son found this. Guys, my son has my eye and I am so excited. I'm digging through, I'm digging through. He's like, here, mommy. Not really paying attention. You know, I'm like half like humoring him and I'm like, oh, hi, baby. And I'm digging through and I look down at what he handed me and I scream super loud. Are you ready? I never, I didn't even see this. This was like buried at the bottom. I screamed so loud. I said, oh my goodness. I said, you just found a Monchi Chi. He had no idea what I was talking about clearly, but this is a Monchi Chi. And he was a dollar ninety nine, half price, a dollar, with the original pacifier. So that's staying in my collection as well. I'm gonna show you some of these huge things that are to my side. I uh, I asked my husband to wipe them down for me with disinfectant, um, so my son could play with them because he was super excited to play with them. But I asked my husband, I said, do me a favor. Can you please just wipe them down with disinfectant? Like just so he could play with them, but just don't take off the price because I still need to film. Clearly he didn't listen to a word I said. And uh, I just went to go grab them to film and the prices are all off. So, but these are the ones that I do remember the prices on. So let me show you. I think some of these are amazing too. I will put any comps that I find on this because I did, I did find kind of similar. This one, believe it or not, was not that... Um, it, it didn't price that well, which I thought it would have, but it didn't. But anyway, I saw this. I thought this was super cool. So this is the like Joker, Batman Joker house. You see, there's a little Batman sign there. <clears throat> and there's like a, a strength -o meter thing, I guess. Um, we got the ha ha ha's over here. Uh, oh, there we go. Oh, you put the little, you put the people in there. And then it looks like they're doing it. And then you have these doors. Uh, a jail back here. They always have a jail. <laughs> the joke's on you, Batman! <laughs> the joke's on you, Batman! <laughs> but anyway, this was $1.99 full price, and I snatched it up. Yeah. So I thought that was cool. My son loves it. Next, I found this. Um, this was also a dollar ninety nine full price, but look how. Oh no, I'm sorry. This was four ninety nine half price. So this was two fifty. But again, I think it's it's totally worth it. And you can you know you can drive the thing out there. The the people you know sticking the people in there is what always 
does these things. So there's another guy here, which would bring out these ramps, pop open the command station or whatever. I don't know what this one does. Oh, okay, that flipped up, whatever that is. I don't know, just, just super, super cool. And I will put the comps there because the little elevator thing. Oh, and he, he has his little Batman in there. Little man just came. He wanted me to make sure to show you um, that it has a whole bunch of bats on the back is what he told me to tell you. Yes, it has all of these bats on the back. That's not a bat. Yes. He just wanted to make sure I told you. So this was his. <laughs> I don't know. All right. So that's that. And the last one of these types of things. I actually couldn't find this online anywhere. I'll have to look um, closer. And if I do, of course, I'll put it here. Um, but I thought this was super cool. This is Hot Wheels. This is uh, Hot Wheels Watchtower, I guess it's called. And you have the police station and the firehouse. So there is, you could put the Hot Wheel in there and then there's a the little like elevator to bring it to all the different floors. Um, there's a little ramp here. I guess that opens, I don't even know. Oh, they come out, they come out of the firehouse and then the police station really really cool and the coolest part of it all is it has this little radio it's so cool I feel like my son was talking into this yesterday, but I don't know. You can talk into it. There's a button to talk into it. This thing is crazy. Okay, and let me tell you the best part. Okay. Okay. It's very stressful. This thing was a dollar ninety nine half price. That's my favorite one. Okay. Moving on. This thing that's been sitting here behind me. Um, this was $4.99 half price. Um, it is, where did I see the thing here? Uh, GCI Outdoor. Again, I'll see if I can find anything. Um, but it's, it's metal. It's completely metal. And it's this foldable table. $2.50. $4.99 half price. $2.50 for this thing is nuts. I have plastic ones that exactly like this that are paid more than that for I swear so that's that okay and then I found this for my son $3.99 half price how could I not get it I would have to be crazy not to this is a discovery kids uh teach and talk tablet over 60 interactive activities and it is um bilingual it's it does English and Spanish so here it is in here. It's, it's what it looks like and it's got the instruction manual. Pretty cool. $2. Yes, so I got picked up that for my son. I also picked up this for my son because I just thought this was really cool. Uh, $4.99 half price, so it was $2.50. This is Explore Within a Medieval Castle. Set out on a 3D adventure as you reveal a medieval castle layer by layer. So he has like dinosaur anatomy books and stuff like that, like, like this. But I just thought this would be really cool. And I thought he could like, you know, just be read all of the, the details. I think he would love this. I don't even know if he saw this when I got it. I just, I think that is so cool. So they're going deeper and deeper into the castle. All the other, you know, pieces stay here. I love these like peel away books. So two fifty for that. Um, and then 
This one I'm gonna have to sit on for a while because I kind of want to keep it, kind of want to try to sell it, but the price would have to be right. So I don't know. But this was, this is from KB Toys. So there, right alone, you know. So KB Toys, it is original box, original tape. It has never been opened. This was $14.99 half price. So it was $7.50. Um, and it is this interactive solar system. So it's, it's a complete like electronic learn about the solar system thing. Lots of facts on our solar system and it's nine planets, over a thousand different quiz questions, light up planets and a fun and interactive introduction to space. So uh, yeah, 750 and uh, I could only find, I'll, I'll put what they're selling for here and then the one sold comp that I found on this. Um, so <laughs> I'll have to say, I'm not making any rash quick decisions. I'm going to sit on that for a little while and see how I feel. Um, next, my son saw this backpack and he, he really wanted it for school. He, I have bought him other ones for school if you've been watching my thrift store hauls, but whatever. He can switch them out and I don't know. Whatever. Um, but it's, it's brand new with tags. Brand new with tags. So it's this dinosaur backpack. Absolutely perfect. And I love that construction. Marker yellow. You know that. He's got 10 t-shirts that color. <laughs> I just love it. So that was brand new. And that was $3.99 half price. $2. Insane. Insane. Brand new. All right. Next in here, I have two clothing items and some breakables that I wrapped in the clothing items. So let me show you the first thing. I found this. I thought this might be nice for a quick resale on Marketplace or something like that. So this says 1998 Warner Brothers, designed exclusively for the Warner Brothers studio. Um, this is a, this is mint condition. No scratches, no, ch this was like no fading. This was in like a china cabinet, I swear. It had to have been but this is a Wizard of Oz glass. And they were asking 99 cents for that. So I picked that up. I, I, looking at comps and stuff, I feel like if there's any collectors, this could definitely be like a quick $10, $10 flip on that. I, I really feel like it could be. But if not, it's really cool. So I don't care and it was 99 cents. Then I got this for myself because it's stinking adorable for around the holidays. It was $3.59 half price. Don't make me do math. It's Ralphie in the bunny costume. I love it so much. So I had to get that for myself. Uh, okay. Then the next breakable and clothing item. And then we are done. Let me be careful not to break them. All right, so I'm gonna show you the clothing item first that was protecting the breakable. So I got this one for my husband for like the winter, for those freezing cold early mornings, um, you know, when he has to go to work. And this was $6.99 half price, so it was $3.50. I thought that was totally cool. Uh, this is an Under Armour cold gear. That's the back. So it's like one of the, it's like a, a thermal, you know? but it's that, um, it's, it's almost like spandexy, but it's inside that you can see the, see that texture, that like thermal texture. But yeah, I thought that was really cool. So it's the cold weather gear. And then the very, very last item in this thrift store haul. Oh, this was just crazy. This is another thing I'm gonna attempt to resell. And again, if small investment don't care and if not i'll keep it because it's like crazy i just i love it so i saw these these are four it's a set of four four gold trimmed etched new york state senate like whiskey glasses what in the world where do these come from how does that happen? Can anybody tell me where these came from? <laughs> How did these end up at a thrift store? Did a senator do donate them? Like, tell me how this happens. I'm very confused. 
but I'm all over it. So New York State Senate with the state emblem there, beautiful. They look brand new. They're so shiny and crisp and clean. Gold trimmed, four of them. And for the four, they wanted $4.99 half price. $2.50 for those four. So you know I'm going to snatch them up. When am I ever going to find Senate glasses again? I don't even know what's happening. But anyway, that is going to do it for today's thrift store haul, guys. Make sure to tell me down below in the comments what you think today's deal of the day or find of the day was in general because I love reading it. And hopefully if this keeps, keeps up and I have the time to go on their six ticket days, I'll be doing this about once a week. So cool for us, right? It's fun. It's fun for me and I hope it's fun for you. So if you have not hit that subscribe button already, I would love if you would consider doing so and becoming a permanent part of the Thrifty Divas family. And uh, that's it. That's it from me for today. It's my second video I'm filming sitting here. So until the next one, guys, stay blessed, my friends. I love each and every one of you.